Well, how many people get to sing their very first original song on television? 16-year-old Madison Ramage from Hopkins County will do just that in a Christmas special for the Country Music Awards tomorrow night. Eyewitness News Cindy Davis tells us how Madison will use her story and her singing voice to bring more awareness to Shriners Hospital for children. Madison was about two years old. She started singing and just kept on singing. 16-year-old Madison Ramage will make a guest appearance on CMA Country Christmas. Her passion for country music, sports, and Shriners Hospital for Children have all come together to make this opportunity possible. Madison was born with an extra bone in both of her feet that landed her in the care of Shriners Children's. Three surgeries on my feet because my bone ended up growing back on my right foot, so they had to go in and do it again. Well, it made it hard for me to stand a whole softball game because the bones were rubbing against my cleats. The nonprofit helps provide free health care to kids with neuromusculoskeletal conditions, burn injuries, and other special health care needs. Madison's mother says before learning about Shriners, doctors recommended shaving the bones and insoles, but nothing seemed to work. At nine, Madison had her first surgery in Lexington, which started her journey into a pain-free life and a deeper love for music. And she was bored sitting at home with non-weight bearing and she started picking up that little fake guitar and playing it and she was like, I'm gonna learn how to play and it kind of just aspired from there. Now, Ramage tells her Shriners story all over the country, and that landed her the opportunity to film for the TV special in Nashville and sing alongside some of her favorite country superstars. Um, I wrote my first song and put the music together all by myself, and I was excited and a little nervous, but it was great, amazing. I mean, words can't describe it. She's hoping her music will speak for itself. I just hope my song gets to the right people, and hopefully the right people see it and know that Shriners Children's is always there for anybody in need. In Nebo, Cindy Davis, Eyewitness News.